This is QCC alum David Russell along with Joe Massey. As far as regular season games go, they don't get much bigger than this. The Lady Tigers and the Lady Panthers taking each other on. The winner goes to the CUNY playoffs and the loser doesn't. They're both three and six. Queensboro in the white jerseys, BMCC in the dark jerseys. Queensboro started off 0-5 in CUNY play and have won three of the last four. And Birch will slow it up, good transition defense. And then she finds Apple over the top. And it's good off glass. 6-2. Apple with four early points. McNeil, corner three. It's good. McNeil from downtown, and it's 9-2. Good defense. And there's Morton with the missed shot, rebounded by Ward. Morton had a pretty good look. Yeah, they got a good shot, but uh, they're outside shooting ice cold to this point. They go inside to Ward off glass. Right and on cue, Dave. Ward outscoring BMCC. She has six and Queensboro leads 13-5. They hit the outside shot. They got the ball inside on a few big plays and uh, they've looked like the better team to this point. But there's a lot more to go in this game. And Duplan left alone for three and she hits another one. Duplan. And there's Brooks, soft glass. Timeout, Queensboro. All right, we'll give Queensboro their due to this point. They're up by one in this game, but they'd like to perform when Apple is on the bench a little better. They haven't done that so far. Atkins, pull-up jumper is good. And BMCC takes a 14-13 lead. 10 on the shot clock. Is due plan for three again. Counted on the foul. A chance for a four point play. Atkins puts it in. And the barrage continues. Atkins the other way. It's been moved down to five, four. Atkins trying to beat the buzzer. Throws it to Ramos. Have to throw it up. And makes it in at the buzzer. What a shot by Ramos, her first points of the night. So the second half about to begin. Queensboro trailing by 12. If they play mistake free basketball, they're gonna be in really good shape. Birch in the corner for three, and it's good. Her first points of the night. They go to Duplan for three again, and it's good. Wow. And Birch with the layup. And it's 36-29. 36-29, Duplan, another three, and it's good. Now she's been deadly out there. 16 points. Up ahead to Birch, who's left alone for three. And it's good. Birch from downtown, she has 11 in this frame. And it's Morton to Brooks, back to Morton, the give and go, counted on the foul. Killer play right there. Back to Freeman, launches a three, and it's good. Freeman from downtown. Atkins to Brooks, double teamed, and Freeman forces a tie up, ball goes to QCC. Freeman getting that very intense look on her face right now. It's been a combination of poor play by the Tigers that got them into this position. So um, what you're looking for now is a very big outing from Apple in the final 639. It's a lot of pressure on her. Looking for a big effort from everybody in the last yeah, 639. Yeah. A long three is no good. And then Birch with the rebound outside. Marva Dudley Adams a corner three, no good. Apple an offensive rebound. Birch for two. Took that one flat footed. Apple with the rebound, a miss. Another rebound, another miss. Another rebound, another miss. And Ward chases it down. Playing their hearts out, but nothing going. Ward alone in the corner, they didn't see her. Dudley Adams for three, she misses. Had about five chances and couldn't score. Very frustrating for Queensboro. They used a lot of energy on that flurry and they get nothing out of it. 
and Brooks going all the way to the basket, and it's good. Oh, that one bounced in for Brooks. McNeil gets it to Birch, to Freeman. McNeil, it's a long two, and it's good. 56-50. It's been Atkins with 17, Duplan with 16, and Brooks with 15. And they've done the damage. They've gotten within seven, within five, with seven, five, eight. But they've never been able to close the deal after they lost the lead in that first half. And BMCC is going to the CUNY playoffs. So congratulations to the Lady Panthers who go to the CUNY playoffs. Queensboro will be back for the Region 15 playoffs. For Joe Massey, this is QCC alum David Russell. The final score, BMCC 61, Queensboro 50.